So I've only been at this canyon a handful of times and in those handful of times um, my buddy's bike blew up and so we romantically rode doubles until we came up on a guy just in time to watch him roll the four-wheeler and break a few ribs and then another time my other buddy's bike blew up in a pretty bad spot and so over the course of a week we managed to try and get in there with a four-wheeler and a small trailer behind it to get his bike out of there the four-wheeler didn't make it in there neither did the trailer the trailer ended up being stuck in there because we couldn't get back out with the four-wheeler and the trailer so then the trailer was in the canyon too and then eventually we went in there with a smaller but like kind of built for off-road pickup truck that didn't make it either it even broke down on the way out in a really sketchy spot on some cliffs and um I don't remember what happened the other few times. I remember it was something good, but I can't remember it right off the top of my head, but I was also talking to a buddy one time about this canyon, and he told me that he's pretty sure he saw a white buffalo run across the trail. There's no buffaloes around here. I've never seen a white one before. So uh, there's some strange things that goes on in this canyon, so we're gonna see how today goes. not gonna go too wild though just because I always keep it pretty mellow on trails like this in case there's someone coming or a deer runs out in front of you or yeah I will I'm not very fast out here anyways <laughs>
gonna give that a retry, just from right there. Heck yeah! <laughs> I can't believe you made it. <laughs> I can't either. <laughs> oh my <laughs> 125 made it okay how do you feel about this diamond how you doing top end good cool how you doing bottom man 500 hours wow you gonna make it though all right good <laughs> Again. We should. How's it going? Good, how are you? Pretty good. Oh. 
Yeah! Nice, that first part was really good. <laughs> 